these two next images you're going to see um, are, I don't have the artifacts for them, um, but they're interesting uh, images of shipwrecks uh, off of Marblehead. This top one is from the Aconia, December uh, 21st, 1878. Uh, Captain Watson was the skipper of the uh, vessel. He had a uh, cargo of potatoes, 1,800 barrels uh, uh, aboard. She had sailed from Annapolis, Nova Scotia on November 29th, bound for New York when he, uh, he mistook uh, the stormy night, he mistook the Marblehead light for the Eastern Point light, thinking he was heading into um, the same, safe anchorage of Gloucester Harbor. Uh, this actual oil pan uh, watercolor was uh, uh, Dave Barry in Marblehead. It, his, his family uh, has owned it, but it was done at the time. You can see Fort Sewell and the uh, Aconia wrecking against the ledge. According to the newspaper articles, the boom, they were in peril of all perishing because the waves were coming over, it was cold and we're in snowy, and the boom swung out, fetched up on the shoreline, and one by one the crew members were able to go along that boom and get off, off onto the dry land. Uh, Cat Island is out in the distance. Um, it, it was named Lowell Island at the time, but, and that was called Children's Island, but you can see that. But it's a pretty dramatic picture. That's the Aconia.